Good-looking and impeccably dressed, CM Lu may look like yet another Korean boy band, but it's actually an indie rock band with humble beginnings. The four-member band performed in the streets of Japan and did live gigs in clubs before making their debut there last year with an all-English mini-album, Now or Never. Then they returned to Korea to debut with the mini-album, Blue Tori, in January this year. Since then, they have won fans all over in Asia, from Taiwan to Thailand, Malaysia and also Singapore. But why did CM Blue decide to make their debut in Japan? Japanese <laughs> 위기의 순간들을 이렇게 겪, 겪으니까 어, 그게 많이 공부가 됐던 것 같아요. 그리고 계속 계속 공부를 하고 있고. 네. The group has come a long way since, and they look very different as well. 외모적으로는 많이 별 변한 것 같아요. 뭐, 조시 같은 경우에는 정말 처음 봤을 때는 정말 남성스럽게 생겼다고 생각했는데 점점 어, 예뻐진 것 같아요. 네. <웃음> 예, <laughs> but looks are not the only reason why Singapore fans love CM Blue. Almost 1,700 fans turned up at their fan meeting Kang Mini concert last Saturday. They are really true musicians. Uh, while they may not be able to dance, but you know, I I really like the fact that they sing. They sing they, when they sing live. They are so powerful in their vocals. I like them because it's like very different from other K, uh, K-pop boy band. You know, they do band. You know, with all the drums and guitars, it's really different. Because I enjoy bands like Linkin Park as well. So they are actually like you know something like the K-pop version of Linkin Park, I would say. <laughs> we are 